Hey everyone, my name is Travis Goodwin with TG Woodworking and welcome to my YouTube channel. This will be the first of many to come, so hit that subscribe button down below. While you're there, click on the bell so you can be notified of my next videos. Today's cutout will be this cool Batman image. So let's get started. Okay everybody, the next step is to get the material ready. So here I'm going to use some uh, quarter inch birch plywood. It's a great material to use for a scroll sign. And also I like to cut two pieces at a time. So I take two pieces and I tape them together. is I've uh, taken the image and I put it on some transfer paper so I can transfer the image onto the wood. So I will uh, square it up here. I'll add some tape on the sides. Kind of like that, just to get the image on there. Now for my image, I use a uh, Cricut to print it out on a, a vinyl. So I can just use the vinyl to transfer it over. And then we'll uh, peel it up, just like that. Okay. And then we'll cut the paper off. Okay. Okay, then we take the tape off, and we do the other half. Then we take the transfer paper off. Okay, next part is we're going to add some holes in the spots where we're going to have to cut out. So, uh, don't like to get too close to the lines because I can always uh, get to them after. So, we have one in each spot here, kind of thing. One right in the center of the nose. And there you have it. Now it's ready for the scroll saw. Okay everybody, now we're gonna to start to cut. The blade I'm gonna use here is a 12.5 TPI Olsen skip tooth blade. I uh, get it from your local hardware store. It'll work just fine for the cut we're gonna do here today. I like to start with the small holes first. And then work up to the big ones.
Now we'll move on to the bigger sections. On to the Batman part.
And now the last piece. There you have it. Okay, now that the cut is done, we're going to uh, take off the tape and the stencil. There you have it. Two Batman cutouts. Now just light, light little sand and uh, throw some paint on it. I think I'll put a frame on it and make it like a shadow box and it'll be perfect. Thank you everyone for uh, watching. Hope you enjoyed my video. If so, please give me a thumbs up. See you soon.